Breaking news right now on the Near East side of Indianapolis. Officers are investigating a shooting that happened just within the last hour or so. Yeah, Fox 59's Kid Hanley just got to the scene there to meet our crew and is working to learn more uh, for us this morning. Kid, what have you gathered so far? Hey guys, I'm here at the intersection of 10th and Rural Street where police have just responded to reports of a person shot. Now I'm going to step out of the frame so you can take a look here at the scene behind me. You can see about nine police cars are here. And if we take a look back there by the pumps, there are a few investigators and police officers. They're still examining the scene and trying to work to find out what happened. Now we do know that police responded to the reports of a person shot just here in the last hour. Officers here located a person with gunshot wounds. Now we're working to confirm whether the person was shot here at the Marathon gas station or whether they were shot somewhere else and then transported here because we do have a witness report that we're working to confirm that somebody saw uh, a van drop off the victim and then drive off and there were two people in that van and that's what we are working to confirm right now. We do know that the victim is in critical condition and was now taken to an area hospital. That's all we know on their condition right now. Now as well it's also important to note that this intersection here in this area does have a recent history of crime. Two people were found shot at this marathon at 10th and Rural just a week and a half ago. And then today, another one. And then just, uh, let's see, three years ago, back in July of 2021, there was a deadly shooting here at the marathon. But the suspect in that one has already been tried, convicted, and sentenced in that case. Now, let's go over what we know. Again, we know that one person was shot and is in critical condition. And we do know that the police are here at the scene. We're hoping to talk to them in the next few minutes to gather more information as to what went down here. But we will continue to keep you updated as we learn more details. For now, reporting live in Indianapolis, Kit Hanley, Fox 59 News. All right, Kit, thank you. The